Greetings and salutations, viewers. I'm Star Princess HLC, and welcome back to Finding Paradise. When I last left off, we were still bouncing back and forth between Colin's memories, still questioning what is up with Faye. We got to see a little bit more of uh, Colin's time with being a father. Uh, he might be a little regretful that he was not there exactly at the moment of Asher's birth, but we're not ent entirely sure. But now we're kind of going back to his first flight. So let's see how this is going to go. Yes, Captain. I want a crest. Do not send me a gourd. And what do they do? They send me a gourd. What's wrong with gourds, man? Is he still keeping journals in this thing? It's just some sort of pre-flight checklist glued on there. Oh, well, that's interesting. Okay. Well, let's check out the back room then. Well, how was the first day? Is Captain Ernest always like that? I really did a thing but sit there. Ah, yeah, you should probably get used to that for a while. Forget about him, though. You got any plans for the night? The other flight attendants and I were thinking of taking you out. Uh, the other flight attendants and I were thinking of taking you out for some drinks to celebrate. Oh, I told them thanks, but I'd better head straight back home. My wife's just about halfway into her first trimester. I'm away for long enough as it is. Wow, double congrats, got name picked yet? Yeah, we're thinking Asher. Wow, you already had the name picked out. Go figure. Alright. What have we got here? Alright, back to the drawing board, I suppose, I suppose. There we go. That wasn't too bad. Ah, that's a nice hat. The one he dropped earlier. Alright. Let's see where this goes. Oh, this must have been when he first went to go talk to a pilot and get to learn to be a pilot. Go on, ask him. Ah, interesting. Okay. Uh, excuse me. Are you a airline pilot? It's a small municipal airport, kid. You won't find any airlines here. I'm a charter pilot. You looking to charter a plane? I'm looking to learn to fly. Can you teach me? You're looking for an early start, huh? Sounds like you want to talk to the flight school instead. Make a turn up ahead and follow the hall. They'll deal with you at dispatch. See, I told you it's worth a try. Hmm. Fair enough, kid. Fair enough. Make a turn up, follow the hall, deal with you dispatch. I don't want to deal with you. I want break. Okay. I also like, kind of like how the logo is literally just a paper airplane. That's a nice touch. Why don't more airline companies do that? Ah, give me my fix, you stupid thing. There's drugs in there? Why do I never learn? I don't know, Barry. <laughs> Well then. Um. What in the world is that? Just saving something for the class. Maybe the head should have been smaller for aerodynamics sake. Who cares? It's got extra propulsion coming out its butt! Oh, aren't you two just the clever ones? Well, there's somebody fine if it's been at this. You never know. Poster of the control panel of a small aircraft. How nice. Okay, it doesn't look like the clock is the thingy here. So... And I have a feeling you're gonna be important of some kind, Barry. I just don't know what yet. Did I just see something where I could look at the ATM machine or no? No. The ATM sh machine does not exist. I may know something about it. I don't think I've seen you around here before. 
Yeah, I'm trying to find out how to become a pilot. Oh, that's simple. You get an instructor and you train. I'm actually working on my own license. Halfway done, in fact. And it expensive to train? Yeah, but that's why I'm working here part-time. The part pays not much, but the discounts on the train fly to hell. I just realized I made you Mr. Hanky for some reason. I don't know why, but I did. Howdy ho! Let's see, anything around here in the cafeteria? No. Well, that's just sad. Dispatch folks, bad down the hall. Down the hall! It's down the hall. We're going down the hall. We're going up the hall now. We're just... We're just going places. I'm ready to go, sir. I got here early, got the weight and balance calculated, and the logbooks are checked. Two words. Low clouds. Yep, you're canceled for the day. Well, that's depressing. Sorry, man. We're at mercy of the weather here. Mother Nature hates you. Get over it. Can I go through the door? No. I don't have enough for door. So I probably need to talk to you. We do a flat train and you do meet the requirements, but it's costly. Is there any other way at all? Well, it's not up to me to say, but I have to check with the owner. He's on break right now and I'll let him know you're coming. The owner of the entire airport? Yep, it's Stanley owned apartment. Pay airport. Not apartment. Well, he probably lives here too. I don't know. I'm just receptionist. His office at the other end of the hall. Did you hear that? It's family owned. What does that mean? It means it's owned by a family. Duh. And also that's probably Mafia. Mafia? Uh, what Mafia? Uh, I'm a Haji, you know. Yeah, just like in The Godfather. Let's go visit. What? Silly kids. Everyone knows that Mafia don't care for the airport. Hey, Monte, folks, it's broken seal. It's coming in at 1500. Huh. Sounds like someone's getting rescheduled. Well then. And not now in the back. Can I go through here? Nope, that's locked. Okay, so I guess we are going in here. You gotta be kidding me. So, you're the kid that told me about. Let the, I don't want any trouble. Of course you don't, son. Don't expect me to do a good Marlon Brando impression for this. There's one out of three that you want to become a pilot. Yes, sir. But you have no experience. No, sir. No background. No. And you have no money. I don't, sir. You had to come here on the day of my own daughter's flight exam to request my hospitality to make use of my facility without an offer. Do you disrespect me at my family's airport? Just tell him you got strong arms and help out around the airport. Uh, I got originally strong arms. Oh, well, are you signing up for work? Yeah. Yes, you are. Uh, yes, I am. Hmm. Interesting proposal. That's true. There have been a few positions opening up, opening up recently. Perhaps we could use a hand. Very well. Your offer is one I won't refuse. Another Amorato sour, Ricardo. And hold the Amorato. Yeah, boss. Kid, you work for me now. And with the earnings, you should pay for your training. One flight at a time. Quick, thank you, and step back. Uh, thank you for your kindness, sir. 
See? You did it! Wait a minute. All that's happened is just that I applied for a job. Shh, you're practically the underboss now! So, uh, assuming exaggeration of memories, is this like racist to Italians? I can't tell. Italian isn't a race, Neil. But he does seem to have a tendency for getting creative with his memories. Hey, maybe that's just what he gets for watching the movie, that movie when he's eight. Anyhow, let's see if the dawn has anything for us. Okay, let's look at the dawn. Uh, let's see, an Amarato Sire without the Amarato. Oh, okay. Sure, this is fine. <laughs> The kids definitely. Colin definitely had some creative tendencies, I will give him that. <laughs> well, that works! Finally, some tropical air. Sick winds, dude. There you go, sir. Your Amarado sir, hold the Amarado. Thanks, just the way I like it. And for you, lady, your Amarado sour, hold the sour. Why, thank you. I didn't know you guys make this. Are you gonna be able to handle all that lemon juice? It's an old favorite. We're actually here. You wanted to visit for a long time now, haven't you? Is it everything you dreamed it would be? Well, and you've got expectations. But yes, it's still beautiful. How about you, though? Mm -hmm. You know, spending half our savings on a delayed honeymoon and all that. Hey, now's not the time to think like that. We'll bounce back up. I got quite a few gigs waiting when we get back. Not to mention your new job, Mr. Airline Pilot. Don't jinx it. It might still be a while until I start with the company. Besides, the pay is not going to be good for a while. Hey, as long as you get to wear the cool shades. I talked with Maria last week. We got the flexible hours arranged. So we're ready, huh? Yeah, as ready as we're going to be. You know, this might be the last trip like this we'll have in a long time. Huh. We'll make the little bastard pay for all the vacations we missed one day. In the meantime, all the more reason to enjoy the rest of it. Here's to the rest of it. Yeah, here's... Oh. Whoops. Smooth, fella. Sloppy start. Yeah, I guess that would be kind of a sloppy start, wouldn't it be? Because you're... You know. That's the... Memento, huh? <laughs> it's like, Honey, you don't need to curse so much, it's fine. We'll just have the house staff take care of it. Ooh, fish. A small, uninhabited aquarium. Well, that seems redundant. I don't know what to tell you. Some people just like fish tanks without fish in them. I mean, to be fair, it's never fun finding them dead. Even in video games, like in Mass Effect 2, I was always like, Oh, come on, stop killing my fish. Come on, Colin, the water's not that cold. I want to eat my marshmallows. Those marshmallows are totally going to get overcooked. What, you don't like them when they're nice and crispy? Whee! That's sweet. Those stone benches don't look overtly comfortable. And if I'm being honest... Okay, so... Maybe on the pier. Go to the pier. That has wooden... That has stone steps for some reason. Uh, 
Okay, I think I go in there for one thing. Okay, yes, it does look like I go in there. Okay. Whoa, what's happening here? Fia, you still awake? Nope. Told you lemon juice is the way to go. Ah. Although that brings up the question of was she drinking it with a lot of alcohol in it? Because if she's currently pregnant right now, that's not a good idea. But I don't know. Faded painting of Bora Bora. How pretty. There's the fish. They're under the boat there. Blank piece of paper. <laughs> Looks like he's about to lay down some rhymes. Huh. Okay. I think there's still some stuff in here we haven't checked. Alright. What am I checking now? Oh! Dead hibiscus. This is more of a suitable place for that kind of flower. Okay, now I got them all. Thank you for telling me that there was more in here, Ava. I appreciate that. Yay! Backtracking! At least it's a beach. It's a pretty beach. It's all nice and calm and lovely. 